but they're opportunists. They'll go for what is easiest to hunt. That's Rory Young. The first time I saw a lion was outside the front gate of our home when I was five years old. A big cat expert who came to Milwaukee back in 2015 in search of the Milwaukee lion for an Animal Planet special. If I was looking out my window and I saw that, first thing I would look around is for my kids because you may as well have a serial killer loose in your neighborhood. He says the recent spotting of a cougar in Brookfield should be reason for alarm. I was surprised that uh, by the reaction of the then D Department of Natural Resources and others, you know, trying to, to play it down and rather safe than sorry. He also says to stay away if you do see one. Don't run away because any, any predator, especially cats, have an instinct to chase. And now, since there have been multiple sightings each miles away, we should all learn how to handle spotting a big cat. Of course, the most important thing is educating people on how to deal with a cougar in their community. That is a question for your local government. How are they going to educate people? What are the steps they're going to take? Because just pretending the problem isn't there, which is what they've done until now, and found themselves to be um, incorrect, is uh, exactly the wrong thing to do. In Milwaukee, Melinda Davenport, WISN 12 News. We reached out to the DNR for comment. They say the animal has exhibited normal cougar behaviors and no indications of aggression toward people have been reported. They add that they do recognize the potential risk and assess any threats to human safety.